Hello my YouTube beauties, it's me again, Brenda. Today I have August Tri Beauty Box. And Tri Beauty Box is a Canadian-based beauty subscription box, but they do ship worldwide. This is a bi-monthly subscription box for $34.99 bi-monthly, so you do pay every other month, and that you do always receive five full-size beauty products. So, I love it when my Tri Beauty Box arrives because, OMG, it's usually really good. So, I'm really excited about this box today because I saw a couple of spoilers, like always, you can't stay away from them. And they do have like a rainbow palette coming in this box and we actually got to customize and pick which palette we wanted because we had a choice from three of them. So I'm not sure if I was able to pick the one that I wanted in time because I didn't see that email till close to the date that they were already sending me my box. So I'm not sure which palette I am actually getting. But before we get started, I would like to let you know that we still have that giveaway going on right now and I will make sure I, I'll put a little card right up here, but I will also link that video at the end of this video so that you guys can go check that out. Everybody's welcome to enter. Just follow those rules on there to enter that giveaway and it's a pretty big one. It'll be like a full Ipsy, August Ipsy box plus other items. I will show you what those items are gonna be in that giveaway on August 30th at noon when I do let you know who the winner of this giveaway is. So if you're not already subscribed to this channel, please consider subscribing. I do many unboxings on this channel. We have a ton of fun. Check out my giveaway video, like I said. And also, I will go ahead and put down here my Instagram and my YouTube because sometimes my videos are watched through other platforms, not just from YouTube, so that that's why I would like to put in my information here so that you can go ahead and follow me if you're not on the YouTube channel now. So let's go ahead and get started. My eyes are already watering because this big ring light always makes my eyes water. So if you see a tear, it's nothing but joy, baby. I did just cut into this and it looks like this when you open her up. And I usually get like a little card Oh, there's no card in here today. Nope, all I got was the little foamy thingies and the products. So I'll look up the prices of these items and I will go ahead and um, put those down here at the bottom so that you could see as I pull up an item, you could see what the price for that item was. So I did receive Priming is Everything Neutral Eyeshadow Primer and this is from The Balm Cosmetics. Now we just received a Balm Cosmetics palette as well from a different subscription, so I'm excited to see what this is about. This is a priming eyeshadow primer. They have such cute packaging. The Balm always has like very colorful, almost comic looking packaging. Okay, and it's a cream primer, so that's what this looks like here. And I won't touch this because I will probably never use this. So I'll go ahead and save this for you guys for the next giveaway. The next item that I see here is from Cass Cosmetics. And this is a Luxe Lip Treatment. And a Luxe Lip Treatment. Let me just show you what this looks like. I don't think I've ever received anything from Cass Cosmetics. It looks like this. treatment but it's a shiny it looks like a gloss and this is in the shade Andromeda this is very pretty actually look how beautiful and shiny sparkly those colors are so this looks like a bronze color with gold sparkles and it is a lip gloss I'll go ahead and give her a little swatch here to test her out this was two swatches here and that's what that looks like I wonder why it says lip treatment. Lux lip treatment. Huh. I don't think I've ever heard of Cass Cosmetics. Let me know in the comments down below if you've heard of this brand in the past or if you've ever tried their items. It does look like it's cruelty free, so that's good. The next item that I have here is from Cargo Cosmetics. And I do love Cargo Cosmetic products because they do make the best waterproof makeup. Um, 
lipstick, eyeliner, blush, waterproof. So I really, really like them. I love using waterproof uh, makeup, so I do own quite a bit of Cargo Cosmetics. I believe this is a blush. And this is in the shade Laguna. And this is the color. That is very nice. So let's go ahead and give it a swatch. I will be keeping this one for myself because like I said, I do enjoy Cargo Cosmetics. Okay, so you do have to build it a bit. So it's right here. But you know, of course, if it's gonna be a blush, you're not gonna need to put so much on. But this is a big pan. And that's another thing that I do love about Cargo Cosmetics. Their pans are always nice and full. So I really, really like this. I think I have a couple of blushes from them, but they might already be expired. The next item that I have here, that I have here, the next item that I have here is from Bella, Bella Pierre Cosmetics. Now, Bella Pierre Cosmetics is one of the pricier, I believe is one of the pricier cosmetic lines. I do have several lippies, eyeliners, several things from this brand, but I don't think I've ever actually purchased it. I think it's just come in one of my subscription boxes. And this is a HD setting spray, high definition makeup setting spray for lasting matte finish, for a lasting matte finish, that's what that is. See, and it is cruelty free it says on here application after applying makeup shake well and hold 12 inches away from face mist two to four times in x and t motion so let's see what this uh mist is like um hi that was probably ten dollars worth of sprays <laughs> okay that felt like I just got splashed by the water hose. I do not like the spray of this. That just woke me up. But anyways, big huge sprayer. This is not a very good sprayer, at least not for setting spray. Um, I just splashed myself and like I said, it felt like a water hose splashing me. So it does smell pretty nice. I mean, it smells nice, kind of smells soapy. I would probably put the liquid from this into one of my Tatcha bottles because the Tatcha bottle sprayer is a very fine, fine, beautiful mist. And I have one bottle that I'm about to run out of Tatcha setting spray in. So I'll just probably pour this in there because, uh, homie, don't play that. Um, yeah, hi, it's me again. For $30, really, they should have a better spray. Okay. And the last item is the hashtag mood palette. And the one that I was telling you guys about that we got to uh, customize. But like I said, I don't think I got the email on time to give them my choice of palette. So they sent me the hashtag mood palette. I'll show you a clip of the other palettes that they did have. So there was a choice of three and I wanted the green one, but these colors look very pretty. formula that Ruby May has on their eyeshadows is so good that no matter what palette I received, I knew I was going to love it. So I'll do a couple of swatches here. So I will start from here going that way, then I'll start, then I'll go here and then move this way. So this one is hashtag drama. That one is a matte. This next one is going to be hashtag chaos. That one is a shimmer. This next one is a matte. This is hashtag OMG. That's a beautiful purple. Oh, yes, baby, yes! The next one is hashtag killing it. This is another shimmer. Ooh. And then we have the bottom row, which is hashtag fire. Look at that. That is like a burnt orange. And that's another shimmer. And then this is hashtag extra. That is a gold. Then another shimmer, hashtag cosmic. That is pretty. And then the last one is hashtag queen. Ooh, look at that. These are very, very pretty. You see that beautiful blue then so you have one, two, 
So I only received two mattes in this palette. It does come with a nice little mirror here, but there's only these two that are matte. The rest are shimmers, which is okay because I can always pull out a different palette to use like a transition shade and you know, those other shades that you might wanna add to this. But this is a very nice palette. I am not mad at it. I am okay that I didn't get the green one, but uh, you know. So that is everything in my box. It's totally worth $34.99 for this box. It's freaking amazing. You get really nice, you know, brand name items. A lot of these are indie brands, but you know, they're very good items. This Ruby May, like I said, makes very, very beautiful eyeshadows that, I mean, the formula is just perfect because it's long lasting. It's you can build it up and I mean look how creamy and beautiful these came out I mean I just can't get over it this one kind of looks patchy but like it was just one swatch plus you guys know that swatching it on your hand is not the same as when you put it on your actual eyelid especially if you're using blenders and stuff or priming or whatever you're gonna use for your eye but like I said so out of these five items again we received the Bella Pierre setting spray we received the cargo cosmetics blush we received the cast cosmetics lip gloss and then we received the balm priming what is it called eyelid primer the color transfer priming is everything it doesn't even say what it's called but it is an eye primer because i mean look at what it says it's a primer for your eyelid and that's what it looks like and it is a cream eye primer i don't like these i don't know why That's everything in my box, you guys. Don't forget that if you're not subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing so that you can become one of my beauties here on this beautiful channel of ours. Don't forget to like if you liked my video. Share this video with anyone you think might enjoy it. Hit that notification bell if you want to be notified every time I post a video. And that's everything. I will see you guys in my next unboxing. Goodbye.